hi, this is me before I met Julie Wolf. And this is me up here with my puppy after I met Julie Wolf. My name is Julie Weissar, same name, different last name. And I do a lot of my business marketing communications on Skype. So when I got hacked, I panicked. And I was lucky enough to be introduced to Julie Wolf, who is a Skype mentor, coach, and has an awesome hack safety and recovery program. And she walked me through the steps to get my account back and even went one step beyond, which was to help me reach out to all of my many contacts on Skype once I had recovered my account to reconnect with them as well as to communicate with them about what had happened. So I wrote a blog post about it and rather than read it to you, because one of the things that I do is I create videos, I'm going to play the video for you because it tells the story better than I can. Oh no, my Skype just got hacked. Skype is a great communication and marketing tool until your account gets hacked. If you're like most people, your first reaction, after screaming of course, is probably to simply open a new Skype account. If you happen to have a CSV file of your Skype contacts, you can add them all at once to your new account. But there are two reasons why this might not be the best idea. First, your old hacked Skype account is out there in someone else's hands with your name and brand on it, and you have no idea what they're doing under your name. More than likely, it is not something you would be happy to have associated with your name. After all, they stole your account. And, as the hacker was able to get into your first account, he or she probably left some unwanted goodies on your computer that may very well be leaving your new account along with all your personal information susceptible to being hacked again. The better choice is to recover your hacked account. You work hard to brand yourself and don't want a hacker to ruin your reputation. In addition, your hacked Skype account may very well come back to bite you and your contacts. The good news is that you can get your hacked account back. The first step is to scan your computer and get rid of the malware you more than likely have on your computer as a result of having been hacked. The three best products to use are Malware Bytes, Super Anti-Spyware, and a vast, but any good antivirus program should do. You want to be sure to rid your computer of any keyloggers to protect yourself and your information. Now all you need to do is recover, and know you can. We know from extensive experience. You see, people have been referring others to Julie for years now to help them recover their hacked Skype accounts. She has a 100% recovery rate, so we know it can be done no matter what. It just takes, in some cases, lots of time and persistence and sometimes a supervisor at Skype Live Chat Support. A recovery kicks out the hacker and prevents them from getting back in again. If you change your password for your Skype registered email, or better yet, change the registered email on the Skype account first, then recover with a change of password, you should be all set. But remember, these are steps two and three. They come after first finding and cleaning the malware. Learn about Skype hack safety and recovery, Skype marketing, and more about how to use Skype to grow your business. Contact Julie Wolf, Skype coach, by visiting seeyouonskype.com. See you on Skype. Now, of course, I didn't learn that information through osmosis. I was able to create the video because Julie walked me through the steps. So I highly recommend to you that if you have an issue with Skype, and even if you don't, because Skype's a great marketing tool, but if you have an issue, definitely contact Julie. You can contact her here. This is her Skype recovery service, and it's, it's member.cuonskype.com forward slash Skype hyphen hack hyphen recovery. Or she also has an ebook. And if you want to try to do it on your own, you certainly can. She has a free PDF, and then she has an ebook that she sells, and that's cuonskype.com forward slash hack, Skype dash hack dash recovery forward slash ebook. Myself, I prefer to have someone else do it for me because I don't specialize in Skype and I don't know what I'm doing, which is why Julie was so helpful to me. And I wrote this blog post which talks about going to Skype Hell and back again. And the back again is all due 
to Julie Wolf. So again, I thank you very much for your time. And I thank Julie, and I highly recommend that you use her Skypack and recovery service. Bye-bye.